Hello and welcome to our channel. My name is Kevin and this is RV Bull. Let's get to it. 2024, bust or boom? I think it's gonna be the next boom. Maybe not for the new RV dealers, but you as a consumer, is this a good time to buy? In my opinion, I don't think it'll be any better. It'll be a lot better than definitely the pandemic and those reasons and why coming up next. Had to come inside. Whew, it's cold this morning in Oklahoma. All right, one thing I wanna to touch on, I'm sure you're thinking, 2024 but interest rates have gone crazy yes they have but I'm telling you with the prices that have dropped on new and used I mean we're seeing 50% discounts on the cheaper newer stuff and I'm seeing used merchandise depending on what it is it could be on an average of 10 to $20,000 less and then when you're talking about like big diesel pushers. I mean, these things are down, some of them a hundred grand. Um, so in my opinion, and we'll talk about this more in another video, but definitely it's a buyer's market. And yes, you should be buying. Okay, so the question here is, will prices continue to drop? The answer is yes, especially when we're talking about new inventory. You have all these dealers, and I know everyone's seen it, you drive up and down the highways. They went from no inventory to now, they have no place to put this inventory. So they've got all these 2022s, and new 2023s that they got stocked in. And now these 2024s need to be shipped out. And the factories, they've got to stay open. They have employees that they have to take care of. So what are they doing? They're putting huge discounts to the dealers on the 22s and 23s to get them moved out so that these dealers will order 2024s. So until they get all those 2022 and 2023's gone, for one, the price of 2024's are gonna be high to help justify buying the others. But they're gonna to continue to lower the prices and lower the prices and lower the prices until they get rid of them. Now, what does that do for the used market? It does kind of help because, yes, prices are going down because there's not that many people out there fighting over the same inventory and these dealers they can't buy used inventory the newer stores because they have nowhere to put them so even when they're trading for them they're getting buy bids to get them off their lot just as fast as they're bringing them on okay what does that mean for me the buyer well pay attention that means a lot when prices drop it's definitely time to buy and in my opinion, this is only going to happen in 2024, or at least for a while. And yeah, things are going to change. Will they change to the point that we'll ever be back to the pandemic times? No. I don't ever foresee us going back to that. And honestly, that wasn't a good time for us used dealers, us small independents. Prices got so high and so ridiculous, we would have sold more units back when things were normal versus the whole pandemic. Because we had to pay those high prices and we had to sell them at those high prices. And now I have to look at all my customers that I did that to that are ready to sell and go, I'm sorry, we had to sell off our inventory at hopefully a loss or a little bit of a loss just to get rid of it because I seen it coming. But unfortunately for the consumers that are out there that bought all this stuff, and God, if you bought new, I'm really sorry, but they're dropping like a rock. 
Will it stop? It'll stop. And it'll stop, I predict, probably somewhere about the end of summertime 2024. I tell you all this because yes, I believe 2024 could be the best time to buy. Prices are really low. Don't let the interest rate bother you. If you have to finance it, it's okay. Finance it. Think of this as a broad picture. We are going into an election. I feel like that's gonna force Biden to lower interest rates. He's gonna want those votes. And then if we get a new president, that new president is gonna be forced to lower rates because he's gonna to have to talk about it because rates are so high, people can't afford it. So at some point, rates are gonna go back down. So at that point, refinance it. Simple, simple, simple. So you saved huge up front, 2024 on the pricing. You got it refinanced, so you only paid a little bit on that interest rate that was high for a little while. So for you, as a buyer, it's a win-win. Kind of a no-brainer. And that's my thoughts on it. We'll have more videos and more detail on different subjects like this to kind of help guide you. So please, keep watching. Thanks. Well, awesome. If you made it this far, then you watched the whole video. We ask that you like and subscribe. That's how we grow our channel. And please leave me your comments. I wanna know the good, I wanna know the bad, and I wanna know the ugly. Plus, how am I supposed to get better if you don't tell me? Again, thanks for watching RV Bull.